Okay guys, here's a short little video of what they ended up looking like after I put a black back on them and I put the handles on the tray. You can see the interference come through. Um, I actually had interference all over this part and uh, when I pulled it out of the mold, the underneath um, where the pattern etching was, it was uh, really dulled out for some reason. So I actually had to take it outside and sand uh, with my electric sander, sand down all of this part to where the interference just stayed in the things in the grooves. So the coasters are gorgeous. The back of this is not that pretty, but I went through hell and back for this one. So I learned a lot about this mold and what to do and what not to do, but all in all, I think it came out really pretty. And the black um, that I used was Loretta's Black Pearl, and I mixed in some Suncatcher with it. So that's what you see, that shimmer. The glitter was Pooh's Honey from Fran's Glitter and More. The interference was all of them mixed up into one. So you get... Uh, I mixed all of the color art interference colors micas together so there's a lot of different colors in there and then the gold mica from Franz glitter and more so that's them guys so um I'll be starting a new set now that I know how this mold works. And uh, I will see you guys on the next one. So pretty. All right, guys. See you soon.